Hello and welcome to this YouTube channel for ACCA FR exam prep. My name is Adam. In this video, I'll be taking you through how to adjust interest paid when accounting for a statement of cash flows. So, uh, interest paid, which would appear under investing uh, under operating cash flow, interest paid will appear under uh, operating cash flow. So cash from operating activities how do we adjust for the interest paid so we we'll look at an extra from a full question and see how we can make the adjustment uh, the details of the question we have kingdom is a public listed manufacturing company is draft summarized financial statement for the year end so we have uh, 30 September 2013 and also uh, 2012 as the comparative. So we have finance cost and this is the PNL. This is the PNL. So in the PNL, we have finance cost, which is an expense 600 for prior year, 600 for current year. Now we go to the financial position statement under current liabilities and pick out the accrual for the uh, interest expense so let's see here we have it accrued finance cost so we have the prior year 2012 50 and we have the current year 100 so the simple uh, process of adjusting is if you owe 50 finance expense prior year and in the current year you have to pay 600 and at the end of the year you owe 100 how much have you paid as the interest so let's do a simple t account again very simple t account it's easier to do it so uh I'll call it interest payable account. So interest payable account. So interest payable. So it's a liability. So the balance brought forward will be on the credit side. And from the question, the balance brought forward as 50 that's 50,000 well the amounts are in, in thousands so let's say we have 50 here then I'll pick the closing balance and put it at the bottom of the right side so balance carry forward which is 100 if you are able to master this you are halfway to solving the question knowing that the interest or the accrued interest is a liability so opening balance will be on the credit side the closing balance will be on the debit now the amount which is charged to PL is debit this is debit in PL but in the interest payable account you would find it on the credit side so what I'll do here is to say the uh, P and L charge or PL expense for the year and that was given as 600 so we can now close this account and know how much was paid as cash so the total here this is 650 this is 650 then the balancing figure which will be the cash paid This will be 550. So we can get the 650. So uh, it's a very straightforward one when you are adjusting for the interest rate. Opening balance, which will be on the credit. You have the uh, PL charge for the year. You compare to closing balance. The balancing figure is your cash paid. So this is what will be shown under operating. 
cash flows to be shown under the operating cash flows as the interest paid as the interest paid i hope this helps in your preparation for the exam please subscribe to this channel to receive updates on new videos